Hey everyone, this is Dan. So let me show you some of the cool stuff that we added to the platform in the past few days. So now in the campaigns and the email marketing automations, you have the ability to see the A-B split testing. So when you do A-B split test, you'll be able now to see uh, what was the winner, what was the loser, what was the percentage. You can see the loser and the winner content if you split test, A-B test your content as well. So that is the information will be available inside of the analytics about your uh, campaigns. Now, the other cool thing that we've introduced is the sales tracking in the campaigns and in the automations. As you can see here, this is a campaign that is uh, tracking sales. And let me show you how simple that is. So when you do your campaigns or automations, so when you do here, let's say sales tracking two. So when you start building your campaign, when you select and go to the next step, select your recipients in the summary, you have the ability to track sales for this campaign. So here you can add your source campaign, your medium, and send and blast the campaign. When you do that, what happens is that inside of the campaign, you can now start tracking the sales coming from your email by you know tracking the source and the things that you are tracking inside of the that you add inside of the campaign itself. And you can see this one was you know clicked uh, open twice, clicked once, and you can see the purchase rate of 32, 33%. So what was the sales? What is the actual value of the sale? Now you have this tab and analytics about the sales happening from this email alone. So you can see the, the information, the, the source. You can also see information about the products, the users, the top sources for all about this campaign alone. So you can easily, easily, easily track all sales coming from your campaigns now. You can also see subscriptions, subsales, and downsells, everything like normal uh, e-commerce analytics. You can also see analytics uh, details, preview and subscribe like just like before, but you can now click also on the users to see information. And here it is something new that also came to the platform. This is the click tracking activity inside of the profile. So you can actually see whoever clicks on a specific link. You can also see it inside of their profile in the activity tab. So this is something new that we also added. So here they click on this link with all the, uh, you know, tracking URLs, uh, UTMs inside of it. Now you can also do tracking inside of the automations, not just the campaigns. So when you create a campaign and you have an email, you have inside to also track sales for it. And in the same way, you see analytics and information about sales coming from that particular email that is part of uh, of this uh, of this chain and that is not only for emails but you can also do it for um, sms as well and whatsapp i believe so you can test out uh, that as well so you can do and track sales very easily for your campaigns so with automation we also have something else that is coming to the platform which is the ability to add uh, new triggers so you have new triggers for um, also for uh, adding members to a group and removing members to a group so you can have that as a trigger and you can also have that as an action as well so now if you have and also have the goal reached so if you reach a goal in a specific campaign you can start an automation here um, um, as, as a trigger you can also do that as an action here so you can also have uh, add and remove people from a member groups which was very requested so you can add and remove people from there on top of the whole other automations that we have added in very uh, lately. We also have the ability for if else to add the or functionality. So if you do some kind of uh, rules, now you have the ability to have ors. Before you only had the ability to add a certain amount of rules and that's it like end. But now you have the or option. So you can have as many as you want different ors uh, into, into the whole flow. So you can create more and more and more rules and that will track, you know, see if they fall under any of the um, you know, statements to be uh, splitting the traffic into the two uh, into the two sections. So this is the simplicity of how you can do um, new automations uh, by using the new triggers, the new actions with add and remove uh, users and members from membership groups and the or for if else logic. And these are the main the main things that's coming to the platform: the sales tracking, the A/B testing, uh, the new automations uh, inside of the uh, automation tools, the triggers, the actions, the OR, and yeah, the sales tracking is I think is really really cool. It can help you really optimize your campaigns and see what is actually coming as sales.
from your from your campaigns so this is it i hope that you enjoyed this update and let us know in the comments below what you think of these new features coming into the crm